Hi, oh, yeah. Say, hey, hi, well, welcome, welcome to the yeah. to the Rose Gallery. Hi, everybody. We love you. Welcome. We missed you. It's good to see you. Anyway, um, yeah, my my fiance is from Vermont, so like, you know, we only have real ma maple syrup in the house. That is one of the Vermont things that Vermont people are snobby about. Which I, I get. Mean, it. it does taste much better. Yeah, I, I get it. I'm not going to judge for that. It's much better than corn syrup flavored like it. 100% better than corn syrup. Yeah. I, I, I With get artificial it. flavor. But any, but like, hey, I could, I could make this. You just, you could make that easily. That's not even hard to make. You can bottle real good, good sterilized bottle. Then, uh, I guess it's probably going to burp. Maybe cover it in a few layers of cheesecloth and a rubber band. Yeah. I'm going to look this up. Yeah, I'm sure there's, there's more recipe. recipe. Oh, there is recipe. If that's all that is required, then there's recipe. But you can just make beer. It's not even hard to just make beer. People ah. do it. I've drank loads of beer that people just made in their garage. You have no idea. <laughs> and you know, coming from the south, I've also drank my fair share of moonshine on more than one occasion. Yeah. Mm -mm, good moonshine. <laughs> uh, Everybody's got a jar of their uncle's moonshine. One of my uncles did offer me $50 once to taste moonshine, and I said okay, and then my grandmother came in and stopped us. So I have not tasted moonshine. Oh, it kind of it kind of tastes like how rubbing alcohol smells. That's what I imagined. It Don't drink rubbing alcohol. That's, yeah. that's methanol, not ethanol. Drink ethanol, which is what moonshine is. It, not is, it has a similar taste profile to what you would expect rubbing alcohol to taste like, but rubbing alcohol will make you blind. So don't, 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 don't. So that's how I do. don't. Gotcha. That is also what is in <laughs> mouthwash. Cannot stress enough. Don't. It disrupts your nervous system. If you if you get too much of it in you, you'll just kind of go blind, and then you won't stop being blind because that's not really a thing that usually goes away when you do that. Yeah. Don't do that, kids. Yeah. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> Going blind seems like kind of a permanent thing. It also, uh, from what I've read, it feels really bad. To be loaded on methanol. Oof. Like, really bad. Because of course it is. Of course it does. Well, it, yeah. It Honestly, it feels quite bad to be loaded on ethanol as well. If I'm perfectly honest. What's this? I think to poke, maybe? It's not pokeable. Oh, I think he's just glowy thing. I think he just glows. He was in the first game, but he glows now. It's one of the only guardians in the entire game that I have seen. Ah. There's another one at the other tech lab, or both of the tech labs have one as well. I think the one in Kakariko has a couple, and the same with the one up on the hill. But yeah, All pretty right. much wiped clean. Hyrule has been wiped clean of guardians. Which I would have thought people would have done, but since some of them get active and shoot lasers at you, I guess people probably just learn to avoid them entirely. Hmm. Where should I go next? Uh, I like I like the the wind place. That's kind of what I was thinking too. I like the Rito Village. Yeah, go go Rito people. Uh, you should make some warm or cold weather food before you go. Because I don't think you have clothes for it yet. Right. Oh yeah, you need food. Okay. Yeah, cold resistance. I have a couple. Maybe, uh, but yeah. yeah, I should maybe make like one or two more just to have a couple. All right. Um, it's one of those status effects that's like easy to work around, but definitely, a, definitely a pain. If something, you know. yeah, something <laughs> to plan for. Let's see where. Is... Ooh, ooh. Do you have any more poop in your pocket? I have no money. <laughs> okay. Do you have any? Do you have any poop? I'm a doctor. You have poop for Hestu? Here, huh? Oh, right. I think we were talking about talking to Hestu before we ended the last episode. I perhaps? definitely did a few. 
Oh, we might be oh. Oh, you're fresh out of poop. Yeah, okay. I think I did that at the end of the last. It's been uh, like a week, maybe it, a week and a half. Yeah, since we played this particular uh, series. What was I looking for? I was looking for a cooking pot. There's definitely one here, but maybe down in the hole. This hole? This hole. Go in the hole. Go in the hole. Yeah, this is the hole. Would have swore there was a Do I have cooking four? pot down here. I think I have three. I bet you've got three. I've got three. <laughs> yeah. ah, wonderful. Definitely three. All right. Cooking pot? Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Ooh. Nobody Hello, knows dear. but me. There's also some swords leaning against that bench in the background. Oh, goody. I'll, I'll take a look at them. I bet you have better stuff than they are, but they're, you know, just worth knowing about. I have picked them up before. Uh... It's better than no weapon, but not, like, much better. Yeah. Was the hole open? You climb- oh, you can get in the hole. I'm gonna look around for those things first. Oh, I'm- I guess I was wrong about that. Ah, here's the cooking pot. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. There's a cook here with a quest for you, but you can also just use the pot. The Hylian tomatoes are great as a base uh, item. They're like apples, I assume? They're better than apples. Better than apples. Hear that, folks? What happens if I try and cook a bomb? There, Does it just explode? I have no idea. They're rice quality. So, tomatoes are on par with rice, which is like a step up, or maybe two steps up off of apples. Hmm. You know, because there's different qualities of ingredients. Like, right. Like with the meats and stuff. They're kind of equivalent to, I think, the second or oh. possibly third grade of meat. So, I know this is going to be posted much later, but... You know the whole Grimace shit? Grimace milkshake thing that's just... How could I not know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How could you not know? He's everywhere. I have, not, I have not had any interest in purchasing one, but I do know of its existence. Thank you. But, I was thinking the other day, what ingredients would it take, do you think, to make a Grimace milkshake in Breath of the Wild or Tears of the Kingdom? Oh. <laughs> oh my. I assume ice choo-choo jelly. Yeah, sure. Blue choo-choo jelly and monster extract. I would. And I feel like there's something else, though. I feel like there's something we're missing. I would say, hold on, go down. Go up. Two. Up one more. Left. Left. Down. That. The cobbling guts. Yeah. Yeah. Just a little bit of grimace in every in every shake. Yeah. I know it would make dubious food in this, but I think the grimace shake is dubious food. I think it's dubious food, folks. <laughs> that said, I'll drink one if you sponsor us. <laughs> I might even like it and comment on that, if I do. I'm not actually very difficult to please with food, and I bet I would like it, and I'm just being judgmental of it, based on, uh... You know, I just can't get the thought out of my head that it's got ground-up Grimace in it, so, uh... <laughs> if it weren't Grimace-colored, I wouldn't think that, but it is, so I do. I know it's his birthday, but maybe it's his last birthday, is all I can think. <laughs> Are they gonna do a whole, uh... How, how old is Grimace? I think he is older than me, at least. He's, he's pretty old at this He's point. from the 70s. He's not quite original, but I think he might be near the beginning. He may even be 60. I'm sure people will write in the comments. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yeah, though. A little bit of right. Grimace in every shake. A little bit of guts, some ice choo-choo jelly, a little bit of monster extract. Yeah. Well, he's a monster. Yeah. Right? Like, what else would Grimace be? He's, I mean, he's not an animal. He's not a person. He's a monster. Yeah. He's, which is fine. Like, I, I, yeah, no, like, I chill with him. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm totally fine with that. I'd fuck a monster. I'm not, like, judgmental. I'd okay. fuck a hot monster. Wouldn't you fuck a hot monster? Are demons I mean, monsters? I, uh, I mean, yeah, I'd consider so. Or is this semantically different? Because, like, I don't know, a demon is has a very specific connotation, but I wouldn't necessarily call. It might describe 
the actions of a demon as monstrous, but I wouldn't call it a monster, the demon. Whereas a monster is just some kind of animal-ish thing. Mm -hmm. A Sasquatch border zone monster. But if a Sasquatch were to exist, we, you know, theoretically know where it came from evolutionarily. That's yeah. at least the argument for why it exists anyway. Uh, so I don't think that's valid. I don't think it, it is potentially monstrous, but a blue whale isn't a monster. Right. It's an animal. Which is fine. But Grimace. What the fuck is Grimace? A monster. Hear me. It feels like that should work, but it doesn't. And it also makes me wonder if that works with stasis in the in Breath of the Wild. What does? You break walls with a rock. Ah. Could you stasis launch a rock at a wall? I would assume so. Because like these I would rocks... assume not. But Can't... that would be like if you put though these rocks do exist in them. They do. These yeah. rocks do exist, and so do, you know, rocks like what you're standing on. And is also attached to your boulder. But it didn't do anything when you threw it at it just now, so I'm wondering if it interacts at all. Yeah. Try and throw it a couple times. It doesn't it doesn't give it the the little splash thing. He doesn't fling stuff, he just sticks stuff to stuff. Wonder if you rolled a big boulder down a hill? I have questions. So many questions. I don't know that it does that fast. Well, let's find out. See what it do. No? Okay. Huh. Didn't maybe if you, so. like, push it really far into the rock surface, maybe it'll oh. smash it. Uh, or get caught in it and break it. That's a good idea. I feel like there's something to that. But maybe we should don't need to test it right now. Oh. This looks meaningful. This just a little patch of floor? It might be. I bet uh, there's the something boys directly wanted to go above a different you. direction. Oop. I'd bet a nickel there's something directly above you. Ooh, bomb flowers. Ooh, bomb flower. You don't necessarily have to commit to it yet, but I want to see if there. Yeah. Uh, I'm definitely going the wrong way. Oh, that's fine. I wanted to uh, go out. Oh, no, that over on the. Go back. Oh, no, no. Oh. Go back to the, where the spot on the floor was. Okay. I just want to see where I'm. Hello? Oh, interesting. Yeah, that cracks. Okay. Very strange. The spot on the floor. Oh, right here. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I guess it's just, never mind. This is nothing. Okay. You gotta it's move just, on. Yeah, it's just where the, the brick is visible there. Sense me! Don't tell me what to do! I'm breaking boulders because I want to, not because you told me to. Whoa. That was a very good hit. Oh, it's this chick. Hi. Hello. I'm inappropriate. <laughs> I'm going to make a bunch of innuendos. I'm very inappropriate. I make off-color jokes and find racism funny. Oh, no. <laughs> The worst statue you've ever come across. I'm like everyone's grandmother and uncle rolled into one, posting whatever bullshit takes I've got on the interwebs for everyone to scowl at. <laughs> Some would call me old. Some would call me a troll. Some would <laughs> call me an old troll. <laughs> I prefer to combine them into trolled. See? I touched you without your consent. Oh. I took your essence. I'm taking it. I wanted it's that mine. back. I have that. <laughs> My touch is as subtle as ever. I told you I was inappropriate. I warned you when you walked up. Now I've touched you. Get the fuck away from me now. Oh, you want me to touch you again now, do you? Yeah, I'll touch you. You want more touching? I need more health. I've been getting my ass kicked. <laughs> you want me to touch you some more? I'm gonna touch you right now. <clears throat> touch! Mostly just wanted to finish this quest. I never want to see you again. <laughs> I never interact with her. I don't like her. You? 
You yeah. asked me to touch you, or you didn't ask me to touch you the first time, but you did the second time. Is it less inappropriate? Even though you had to get something back that I took from you? Are you very soul, some might argue? Eh. I'm gonna keep going through the cave now. Mm. It's a cave, so there's gotta be a, a bubble fish or a bubble frog in here. Yeah. A bu 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 bullfrog. Bu 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 bullfrog. Did I make an axe? There's. I don't think so. There's usually uh, claymores and stuff that spawn underneath these rocks as well. Keep your eyes out for those. Mm -hmm. It'll spawn those rocks that you can make hammers with, but it'll usually toss a claymore in there too for good measure. Which I gotta say, not it doesn't make a lot of sense, but it is it is cute and convenient. Because <clears throat> truly, can you imagine how frustrating it would be to be in your situation with no recourse? Yeah, like you know the one you're in right now. You might have some of those Zonai remote bombs, which I don't find terribly useful ever. I often will use them in here. Progress! And even still, I wish they were- ooh, check out them gems, though. Yeah. Wait, hmm. what, what was I talking about? I don't know. I was barely listening to you. Huh. <laughs> I'm sorry. No. Oh yeah, the remote bombs. Oh. There. Yeah, it looks like it's it. <laughs> but I yeah, found a bar. Yeah, there you go. There's all kinds of rocks behind you. Ooh. We're all through the hole. I'm sure there's a frog in here. No frog in here? Hmm. Could there be no frog? Well, that's cool. Truffle. It's like a mushroom grotto. Yeah. I love it. A little mushroom hole. Very possibly something curious about it. The. I. Nope. The fact that I could do this didn't occur to me at all in the beginning of playthrough the playthrough of my game, and I went to the bottom of a cave. I was like, oh, well, shit, I don't want to walk all the way out of here. Do I have to teleport out to get out? And I didn't want to walk out, so I did teleport. And only later did it occur to me that I have a power that lets me ascend through the ceiling. Which I gotta say, really cool mechanic to combined with the everywhere caves. Ooh. 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 There's stuff. Ooh. You can climb go. through that. Yeah. Who would have thought? Let's... Okay, I've been using this. Chop his face right the heck off! Oh, don't. Don't get too close. Ooh. Oh! Yeah, ah, that damn. was... Yeah, you, I usually shoot that when he sticks it out the first time and then you can chop it. Oh, he stole my sword! Well, he's a lifelike. It was in your hand. If you don't have anything in your hand, he won't take it from you. But if you have something in your hand, he takes it. And I know that because I've never seen him take anything and I always have things out of my hands when he takes me. Yeah, eat, eat Sidon. Yeah, there you go. Eat Sidon. Huh. What am I doing? You need Just to... Oh yeah, just shock his ass. Whee! What are you doing? Oh. Oh, I see what you're doing. I don't see what you're doing. Oh, I do see what you're doing. Yeah, there you go. Fuck you, like like. Have my sword back. You're like like an ass asshole hole. Thank you. I wanted that. Well, fuck you. Oh, jeez. Valuable. All right. Um, I'm still just kind of below the thing. <sighs> yeah, but there's more cave. Yeah, I know. Ooh, frog. There's cave and frog. Frog friend. Perhaps frog fiend? Fiend of frogs? Hello, I'm a frog. 
the most fiendish of frogs. Yeah, yeah, okay, this is somewhere you've been. Yeah, the cave went off this direction. This Indeed. is the other path I want to take. This is just some cave that you used to know. Yeah. I don't know how to follow that up. I want to, but I don't know how to. But you didn't have to smash me out. <laughs> Hit me with the hammer and collect my opals from me. You're much better at that. Said I'm just a boulder though. Now you hit me and you're leaving your home. Somebody. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got some amber. I feel like there's something up from here. Like, yeah. Like get a little. These. Yeah, get these. Get these guys. Like a little platform over to the left here, or maybe I'm just miss. Maybe I'm just seeing things in the dark. Oh, wasn't quite what I meant. But oh, well, let's see where I what where I am now. Nowhere, nowhere new. The town of nowhere, nowhere's view, some might call it. Hmm. Did we set a timer? I did. Yes, oh, it wow. is going. We have about fifteen minutes left. Look at you. Yeah. Go is this what you were talking about? Maybe. No, there's there's higher. Like, look look up. Like right there, to the left. Is that like a platform? I don't think so. Oh wait a minute. You know what I just realized? Oh, oh. yeah, shoot a throw throw a shoot a thing. There's a small one. You can sort and they'll be next to each other. Most of you. There you there go. We go. <clears throat> okay, it's not really anything. Ah. I love these mechanics. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I'm done with this cave. I am now going to investigate what that red marker was. <clears throat> and Nobody knows. Yeah. Nobody knows. Nobody knows, except anybody who's been watching this for a little <laughs> while. Yeah. If you've been watching this, like, in one You're sitting. nobody. No, you're somebody, and I love you. But you're nobody, and nobody knows. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen, though. At least nobody knows. There's a, a shrine thingy over there. Oh yeah, the red light is a tower. Yes. Ah. Ah. Oh right, that was the first tower we made. Oh, oh yeah, we mark. were going the wrong direction. Yeah. Yeah, I know you feel. Oh, like I feel awful. Shut up, Giuseppe. My name's not even Giuseppe. Don't care. <laughs> Take his sword, run away, giggle. Yeah, I do need more. Take his sword and run. Oh, oh I'm taking my sword. Oh, I'm all sad now. Ah, oh, shucks, I'm out of water. Super yeah, ladle. now you're talking. Oh yeah. Weapon of champions. Oh you yeah. Should put the diamond on the soup ladle. I have a better idea. What is? Oh, you're gonna turn it into a wand. Yeah. Great power. Are my you other stole... diamonds? Oh wait, just go by type. Yeah. Come on. Do, 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 Come on, gems. Here we go. Kind of. What kind of wand are you gonna turn it into? I'm about to go into. Well, I. I'm gonna just go with red. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh, oh shit! They yeah, blow you can't, up. You can't... Yeah, you need to... I thought it was just going to land on the ground like a rock. No. Why didn't you tell me it was going to I blow up? I didn't <laughs> realize you were trying to throw it. I... I... Oh. Oh, no. Oh, you died. <laughs> that killed me. Yeah, that was a huge explosion. Yeah. And I think it wasted one of my I, stuff. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's gone now. <laughs> you feel awful. Fuck you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Aw, shucks. <laughs> Nope, okay. Oh, it's still here. There you go. Set yeah. it gently on the ground. I should go get the soup ladle. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> you explode it so you don't have that anymore. <laughs> you might want to put it on something with more durability than a soup lid. Fuck you. No, you know what? It's the perfect one. Ooh. Yeah, I'm yeah, gonna yeah. talk to you because you picked up my sword again. Maybe yeah. save before you try and do this this time. I don't know. What am I gonna, how am I gonna fuck it up twice? I don't know, maybe you will. <laughs> what are the odds of that happening? Oh, okay. Did you just pick up- Okay, I thought you picked up the ring. Hooray! You've got a wand to fire. Hooray! You started a, a, a field fire. Woohoo! Whee! Whee! <laughs> oh god, it's thundering. Maybe I unequip anything metal. Oh, that's fine. Oh, that is- that bow is not fine. My other ones are fine. Yeah, it's the only not fine bow you've got, but it was very not fine. It's made of silver. It's extremely conductive. Can you hear me? Oh, yeah, he's coming. Come here, boy! Horsey! What's your horse's name? I forget entirely! I'm sure it's something fun. Fun and original and clever. Like, credible floppins or something like that. I believe it started with the B. Huh. Bud bug bud bud fuggler. No. This is like Burgle Poppin. Blubbin Blubber Deppin. Bibble Fubble Bubble. Dibbly dibbly do. A dilly diddly daddly. Oakly doakly. Oakily doakly. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Krusty Wusty. Ooh! Fire! Oh! Oh, okay. I'm gonna keep running. Yeah, you, uh... I thought if I, like, I thought I could pick it up as I went by. You, I think, hit them with a... I did. With your wand of fire. There's spikies under that. I wonder if there's spikies that burn. Oh yeah, there you go. They have a little ramp. Oh. Assault! Assault the force! Shoot their rope! Dulse them frontally. Woohoo! I'm gonna not have my fire. That's very oh. don't yet. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Don't do that. Let's see. Your Zonai swords are fine. Yeah. Yeah, spear. Here you go. Oh, he had fireproof. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I wonder how far back that's gonna put you. How? Oh no. I wonder if you... Uh, I wonder how back, far back you are. Uh. But let's see. Holy oh shit. god! That's worse. That's much closer than I expected. Oh, but the thing is up. Yeah, but he he's shooting. And he if sure he... is. He's shooting you Thank really you, good. Thank you, Sidon. Sidon is a great distraction. He can't even die. God damn it. All he can do is get knocked down. But he'll stand back up. You're never gonna he's keep gonna him knock down. Me down. Never gonna turn around. Never gonna run away and desert you. How did you end up doing a Rick roll? From I'm always Not doing down. a Rick roll. I would have thought you would have gone with the song that contains the lyrics. I get knocked down, but I get up again. Like what I was doing. I don't remember no, that, that was... song you're talking about. I get knocked down, but I get up again. You're never gonna keep me down. I get knocked down, but I get up again. You're never gonna keep me down. Pissing the night away. Pissing the night away. Do you really I not do know not the song? know the song at all. I have no idea what you're singing. I'll be damned. There we go. Our, uh, our age difference made itself very apparent right then. It's all right. You know, I don't Although, really know a lot of culture. No, yeah, that song came out in the early 2000s. I don't think yeah, that's... Yeah, that's, that's more nothing. me I think that's not a really... Yeah, that's me more not just keeping up with music. And not to just sit things. here shaming you, but no, this that's is fine. your fault. 
I was a very sheltered child. Not sure if you've noticed that about me yet. I can't think of who the song is by. I think it's one of those late 90s, early 2000s bands with like a catchy well, I know a song that name. I can always remember the artist of. Like Hooba Stank or Chumbawamba, but I don't think it is Hooba Stank or Chumbawamba. <laughs> I will always know the author of. Oh, hey, this tree rolled in. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna turn around. Or desert you. Never gonna make you cry. Never gonna never say, say goodbye. goodbye. Never gonna, gonna turn, turn around. around desert, desert you. Or I guess it's never run around. Oh, hey. Hey, friendo. It's Addison. I love Addison. Who doesn't love Addison? Right? The best name. It's a great name. Cool people have that name. Do I not have an axe? They may not always have the best hair, but they're doing their best. That's an Addison standard. We're <laughs> Akfrond. So I like him because sometimes you have to get creative with how you solve him. There's always a, like something nearby with which right. you could solve it. Um. Yeah, like the log on the ground behind you might be a hint. <laughs> chop chop! With the chop chop fruit! Pick up the Korok runs. In a minute. The Korok runs! Oh god! Pick them up! They're sparkly! <laughs> you can carry an infinite of them, I think. <laughs> Maybe? These are fun. I like these. Plus, it gives you all kinds of great shit. Mm hmm Yeah, he, he, he gives the uh, triple reward. Yeah, he always does a triple reward. It's pretty right. much always worth it. He'll give you cash, some food, and something useful. Sometimes it's a gem. Sometimes it's uh, a rare reagent. He's given me bomb flowers before, which I love. <laughs> that work? 